has been sharing the challenges that the charity has been facing during the pandemic and how the charity is still raising money to keep going. Acorn supports families across the West Midlands and its three sites. Well, it needs to raise two million pounds to keep its Warfall Hospice going. That's the, and despite COVID, the fundraising continues. It's a place that's a lifeline for many families. The Acorns Children's Hospice cares for children and their families, supporting them through difficult times. The challenges families that use the hospice face can be difficult enough. Factor in everything that's happened over the past nine months or so, and it makes things even more difficult. I think um, you know, we have very special staff and I think that the, the major, um, our staff are always thinking first and foremost about the children and families and obviously what we know how awful these lockdowns are, it creates uh, immediately, uh, our staff feel very bad about that because while we do what we can, we know that it's so tough for those most vulnerable families. Charlotte Cleary's daughter Amy has cerebral palsy. Amy loves spending time at the hospice, and it gives her mum a chance to rest. The staff there are angels in uniform, and uh, whenever she goes, she's very happy, she's very loved, she's very cared for. And it just gives me that peace of mind, knowing that she's in a safe environment where they are fully trained, and they know what to do if anything was to happen. And it just gives me time to be me. So, um, yeah, it's really important. The charity needs to raise a large amount of money to keep going, and the fundraising is still going ahead. David Wall is aiming to do five million steps this year to help get them a bit closer to their two million pound target. It's one of them places, unfortunately, you don't get to know about it until someone happens to you, like, you know, you have to control or whatever. But I saw the appeal online, I, you know, I was ready to, you know, with all the kids and you think about it, and I saw the right heart. The hospice has been an important help throughout these challenging months for many families and the charity is doing all it can to carry on being there to support those families through whatever comes next. COVID-19 